Hello guys, <clears throat> in this video uh, I will try just to uh, mention something. Um, s some beginners, they uh, when they begin to trade, they have what we call a uh, trading fever. Y you know, when they begin to trade, they have some money in their account and they like some uh, stocks and they, they, they just try to buy and sell, buy and sell, buy and sell, buy and sell without without doing a plan for the trade without doing why they, do they buy this stock uh, they, know, they don't know when to enter they don't know where to exit most of the time they don't put uh, a stop loss thinking that uh, stop loss is a bad is a bad choice because it uh, remembers them or it reminds them that uh, maybe they lose money so they don't they don't want to hear about losing money so they continue with this action of it's like a fever it's like a uh, it's like the golden rush in uh, uh, in uh, California in the 1848 uh, where all the people he heard of uh, of gold in California and all the people go there to search for gold it's like and it's like the news and uh, a lot of stuff so trading is the same when you are a beginner you you see th yourself that you trade a lot okay either you do day trade you do a swing trade or you do position trade whatever trade you do you see yourself doing a lot now what you should do is you should uh, stop trading check how many trades you have done in a week or in a month and you should try to limit your trades now why you limit your trades first about commission because you are paying too much because you are doing too much too many trades and I, I am sure most of the trades they are losers even if a few they are like you win a few trades but you don't leave them uh, for long in order to get your money so you get little money and you lose always a lot and you don't f uh, put a stop loss now in your account you will see that um, these commissions take too much of, of your profit if you have your profit okay you see for example it, it, try just to uh, just uh, just try to count okay multiply if you do five trades a week okay 20 trades a month now 20 trades so 20 trades just an example by five it is $100 now when you sell is another $100 so in 20 trades you spend $200 each month just for commission okay so if if your account is very small and you are getting 400 500 600 dollars if you have a profit this is just let's say that you have a profit so if you have like 400 or 500 dollars and you take two hundred uh, dollars for uh, like just just commission it just you are giving too much money to the broker and the broker is very very happy uh, that you trade a lot and because they make money uh, they are there to make money if you trade a lot now what I advise you to do is stop trading check one month two months three months check how many trades are you doing Okay. Now, when you, when you check the trades, uh, try to limit them by half. Okay, limit them by half. This is the first step you do, and then try to do a plan for the trade. This makes you stop from doing a lot of trades, and uh, put good money in it, and. You will see that your uh, your trading techniques will develop, okay? And you will get more money, and at least those money that you lose, 
in other trades if you don't give too much uh, too much uh, like a, a commission you will save for other trades okay at least you have money to continue trading which in the first year or second year the most important thing you do for your account is to preserve your money from losing that much because when you when you trade a lot it's like you have a fever okay you do a lot of trades a lot of trades so you don't think about what you are doing and then by the end of the year you see hundreds so you see thousands of, of, of trades and then when you calculate all these trades you find that all your money all the trades you have, you have done all the money goes to the broker okay you enter you exit you enter you exit you enter you exit so where the commission goes goes to the broker and you you have nothing by the end of the year even if you have some money but but your uh your uh, commissions take all your profits okay this is just an advice about trading fever uh, and I just try to help you as much as I can please if you have any question uh, related to this please ask uh, questions send me a private message comment here and give me your opinion if you have another opinion or another another way to do things just share with me here and share with the other guys that are like 